The iOS 26 developer beta is finally here. And in this video, I'll show you how to download and install it for free. So before we start with the video, you have to keep in mind that this is the beta version for developers, which is full of bugs and glitches. So if you want to install it on your main device, maybe it's a good idea to wait till September for the final version. But if you want to get it now, you'll first need an Apple developer account. And if you have this account already, then you can skip this step. But if you don't, then open Safari on your iPhone, and then you'll want to navigate over to developer.apple.com, and that will prompt you to this developer page. And creating this account is absolutely free. So once we open this page, the next step is to tap on the two lines at the top left of the screen. Now find this account option somewhere at the bottom. Then they'll prompt us to log in with our Apple developer account. But since we don't have that, We'll tap on the Create Your Apple Account option here. One of the last steps is to simply enter our basic information, like our first and last name, out email address, and similar things. So just follow the on-screen instructions on this page, fill out the form, and then you'll have your Apple Developer Account, which we will use in order to get the iOS 26 developer beta. Let's now exit the Safari web browser and open the settings page on our iPhone. Navigate over to this General section. The next step is to open the Software Update option, and then you'll see the Beta Updates section, which you'll want to open. Maybe it's set to Off for you, but you'll see the iOS 26 Developer Beta option, which you'll select, and then you will have the option to download and install the update. But if you don't see the option for some reason, then you first need to make sure that you are logged in with the Apple Developer account, which we had created, because this won't work with the regular Apple account. Also. If you're logged in with a developer account but iOS 26 isn't showing up, then try restarting your iPhone once or twice and check if that fixes your issue. And you can see that I have the iOS 26 software update in the Updates section, so all I have to do now is to tap on the Update Now button and then wait until the software downloads and installs on your phone. Tell me in the comments down below if this video helped you and if you were able to install iOS 26 on your phone. Also. Tell me which is your favorite feature in this update, and if you like the new design of the user interface and the icons. Thanks a lot for watching, everyone, and I'll see you soon.